Hello and welcome to Vision Academy. My name is Hanuman Ladwa and in this video we are going to write a C++ program to input the total amount in a bill. If the amount is greater than 1000, the discount of 8% is given. Otherwise, no discount is given. Output the total amount, the discount and the final amount. Let us write the preprocessor directives hash include in an angular brace. We will write iostream.h header file and the next preprocessor directive is hash include in an angular brace we will write console input output dot h header file now let us write wide main function curly open brace in a declaration section we are going to declare all the necessary variables which are to be used in the program using the data type float amount discount is equal to 0, 0.0 so I'm going to explain this why 0.0, I have taken here. Next comma, next, next net discount, net amount, and then put semicolon. Let us write CLR, SSCR function. Then we'll ask the user to enter the amount using cout statement stream insertion operator in a double quotation mark. I'm going to write enter amount. And the double quotation mark and put semicolon we will receive the input from the user through the keyboard using scene statement stream extraction operator and here i'm going to use this variable called amount and then put semicolon and now we are going to check the condition so here in the question they have given if the amount is greater than 1000 then discount eight percent has to be given if this amount is not greater than 1000 then no discount means zero discount so that's the reason i have equated value 0, 0.0 to the variable discount now let us write if the entered amount is greater than or equal to 1000.0 because it is floating point number now we have to use the discount variable so here i'm going to write discount is equal to they have given eight percent eight percent can be written as eight divided by hundred so you can write eight point zero hundred point zero and then put semicolon now i'm going to write net discount net discount without any space is equal to amount into this variable called discount and put semicolon now i'm going to calculate net amount is equal to amount minus net discount so here i'm going to write net discount and put semicolon let us print the value stored in net discount and net amount using cout statement here in a double quotation mark i'm going to write net discount is equal to end the double quotation mark stream insertion operator and here i'm going to write uh, net discount net discount stream insertion operator will use end l and put semicolon c out and now i want to print net amount so in a double quotation mark i'm going to write net amount is equal to end the double quotation mark stream insertion operator and the variable net amount I'm going to write stream insertion operator and L and put semicolon and now I'm going to write here get ch function curly closing brace so once uh, we compile and run this program it will ask the user to enter amount here I'm going to write output and then enter amount so for example I'm going to enter 1000 exactly right so amount value is what now the variable amount is holding 1000 so here amount is 1000 which is greater than or equal to 1000 that is true once it is true then this discount will be calculated here i am going to calculate discount 8 divided by 100 gives us 0 0.08 here I'm going to write discount is equal to 0 
okay next net discount can be calculated as i'm going to write net discount is equal to amount is what 1000 so i'm going to write 1000 into discount discount is 0 0.08 so this one will become so if you shift the decimal point onto the right hand side after multiplying this 1000 so three zeros you can shift one two and three so it will become 80 okay so 80 is initialized to net discount next we'll calculate net amount net amount is equal to amount minus net discount amount is what amount is 1000 1000 minus net discount net discount is 80 so here 1000 minus 80 gives us 920 which is initialized to net amount and next we are going to output net discount so it is going to print net discount is equal to net discount value stored in this variable is 80 then it is going to print just because of this ender which acts as backward slash n which is one of the escape sequences that brings the cursor down to the next line here i'm going to print net amount i'll write net amount is equal to so that is the value stored in net amount so what is the value stored in net amount that is 920 so 920 is payable by the customer and net discount is 80 now let us take run 2 so let us consider this is run 1 and next we are going to take run 2 so second time we are going to execute this program once again now once again it is going to ask the user to enter amount for example this time i am going to enter 500 which is less than 1000 so here we are going to check out amount is what amount is holding the value 500 so as soon as the user enters any value which will be stored in a variable called amount next we are going to check out if amount is what amount is 500 which is greater than or equal to 1000.0 no it is false once it is false then this discount will not be calculated correct next we are going to execute this statement and the next statement now i am going to write net discount is equal to amount into discount what is amount amount is 500 into here discount is not calculated but we have already initialized this variable with the value 0, 0.0 so it is going to multiply with 0, 0.0 so 0 into 500 gives us 0 only right so next it is going to calculate net amount i'll write here net amount is equal to amount minus discount so amount was what 500 minus net discount so net discount was 0 so 500 minus 0 gives us 500 so this is the net amount payable by the customer without any discount because the net uh, amount value is less than 1000 next it is going to print net discount here it is going to print net discount is equal to the value stored in net discount is 0 so it is going to print 0 then it is going to print net amount is equal to here net amount is holding the value 500 so it is going to print 500 now let us execute this program for that i will take you to my laptop screen here you can see i have already written this program in turbo c plus compiler to save your time let us compile this program by pressing alt f9 here it is showing success that indicates there is no syntax error now i'm going to press enter let us run this program by pressing Control F9. Here it is asking the user to enter amount. For example, I'm going to enter 1000 and then press enter. Here you can see it is printing net discount is equal to 80. Net amount is equal to 920. Now let us run this program one more time by pressing Control F9. Now we are going to enter the amount less than 1000. 500 for example. I'm going to press enter here you can see it is printing net discount is equal to zero net amount is equal to 500 
I hope you understood this program. If so, please write down in the comment box as understood. Thank you.